Ooh, ooh, ah, 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 ah. What's up, y'all? Joint Psycho here, coming at you with another Psycho Joint. Today, I'm at one of my local ponds, and I would really like to get in some micro fishing and some pan fishing. So let's see how it goes, y'all. Down there is where we're gonna be going, but I'm gonna be throwing y'all in the chest rig so I can get down there safely. All right. Time to head to this little kind of honey hole, actually. Step over the rail and uh, water's looking juicy today. Sometimes you gotta step over a couple railings to get to that, that sweet spot. All right. So this area right here, I tried it out once and there were a whole bunch of bluegill, a whole bunch of little tiny fish. So I told myself I was gonna come back here and try it again. It doesn't look like much, but thinking uh, I think we might get lucky today what I'm using is just a minnow on a little yellow jig head nothing too crazy but I'm thinking it's gonna get some activity going so let's see how it goes I'm gonna come down here first and try it out a little precarious it did just rain last night might have to stand on a couple rocks. Okay. Looking good. That's the setup right there. Let's uh, do a couple casts, see what happens. Okay, that's a great way to start. Well, y'all, you can't really throw it if it's uh, wrapped around. It's a good joint psycho moment right there. All right. First cast, y'all. Let's see if we can get any nibbles. Oh God, I just already got some tugs already. There's, there's some fish down here for sure. Oh, 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 we got something, boys. Yes, sir. Oh, first fish of the day. Let's go. Yes. A nice, actually, oh, this is a much bigger crappie than I thought would be in here. Let's go, y'all. Uh, uh, I just hooked myself a little bit trying to get this sucker. Oh man, you guys are watching me flop around with this guy. I swear. Let's go. Officially a catch. <laughs> wow. This is actually a good little spot down here, y'all. Awesome. Well, I am super happy with that. That is actually a nice little crappie for down here. And this little spillway. I would never be expecting a crappie of this size down here. That is awesome, y'all. I'm gonna go ahead and release this guy down here, but that gives me hopes for down here. A little micro pan fishing going well already. All right. See you later, bud. Ah, oh, he's swimming back into the rocks. The other way, the other direction, my friend. Oh, he's gonna recoup right there for a little bit at least. Woohoo! First fish of the day. Gotta climb up some sticks. That is awesome. That little crappie really went for that jig head with just a little minnow on it. Awesome. Let's throw it back in there and see what we get. I'm using a telescopic fishing pole from Ozark Trail, so it condenses and fits in my car really nicely. I'm really liking it so far. This micro pan fishing is super fun. You kind of never know what you're going to get. 
Oh, just got another nibble, y'all. There are fish over here. There are definitely some fish over here. Sometimes the pan fishing is even better than the bass fishing because you're getting that many more bites. Kind of throwing it at the very beginning of that spillway. I'm thinking there's gonna be fish just waiting at the beginning of it because I'm I'm wondering how they all got down here besides from that spillway. Oh, I might be snagged. Oh, I'm snagged. Come on. Ugh. This sucks. Come on. No. Oh. It was going so well. Okay. Well, you know what to do, y'all. Tighten up that drag and go ahead and pull backwards and hope to God that you got it. Uh, all right. Let's see if I got, got it out. Yes! <laughs> ah, I did not expect to be able to get this guy out. That was luck. About 99% of the time. Oh, yeah. No, that's how I got it out. Look at the hook. Completely messed that one up. Let's see if I can just bend it back. <sighs> we don't like wasting hooks around here, y'all. All right, bent that sucker back a little. I think that will do. Nice. More likely to get some nibbles over here. Ah, it's more precarious, but you gotta do what you gotta do. That's why I don't, that's why they call me the joint psycho. I'm getting some nibbles, y'all. Yes, fish on, y'all, fish on. Let's go. Nice, second crappie, y'all. Oh, he came off the hook. Oh, he came off the hook. He must have barely been on. <laughs> well, we had a second fish on. Two fish already over here? I'm happy. We're not going to count the second fish, but we're going to count it as a uh, almost catch. On the bent hook. Told y'all, we don't waste hooks around here. Definitely some little crappie in here. Let's catch ourselves a bluegill, maybe. Fish on, y'all, fish on. Yes, sir. We got ourselves a nice little guy. Yeah, this is so much fun, y'all. I swear. Oh my goodness. No way. A little bass? Oh, what? I did not think a little bass would be in this water. Come on, what? He is a feisty guy. I got you, I got you. Wow. Dude, when I said I was micro fishing, I was not kidding today. I know I said pan fish, but we got baby bass too. Oh, wow. This is so cool. I, I'm not used to catching bass this little. This is so, this is so much fun. That's awesome. I had no clue there would be bass in this water. I really thought it was gonna be mostly just uh, crappie and uh, bluegill. I'm trying to get this dang hook out. I bent it so well that it's a, uh... aha. Look at that little guy. That's too much fun right there, y'all. All right, you stud. Time to get back in the water and get even bigger, my boy. I don't know if I'm going all the way down there for your release. I'll see you later, bud. Be healthy. Yes, sir. See ya, bud. That's awesome. Yes. This micro pan fishing is going pretty well so far. I am having a good time with just this little jig head in a minnow. That is all you need, y'all. I'm gonna keep tossing it in here and seeing if I can catch anything else. So far we got a little baby crappie and a little baby bass. So 
Let's keep up that multi-species day. Maybe a little bluegill, a three-species day. That would be awesome. Hey, back in the same little spot. They're definitely fishing here. <laughs> Let's keep it going. Just thread it on like so, and you are good to go. I mean, that's a pretty presentation. What wouldn't eat that? Y'all, I might have a fish on. Yes, sir. Oh, maybe not. Wow, I do. He was that small. Oh my goodness. Guys, when I said I was micro fishing today, I was not kidding. <laughs> Wow, look how small this bluegill is. Oh, he's gonna come off for sure. Oh, buddy. Relax yourself, relax. Wow. Just look at how small this guy is. Wow. For comparison, there is nothing more fun than that, y'all. A little micro fishing, three species today, and a beautiful bluegill. That is gorgeous. And they wonder why they call them bluegill, right? So pretty. What an absolutely pretty fish. Thank you so much for biting, my friend. I'm gonna go ahead and let you go, buddy. That is too much fun catching those little fish, man. I've had four fish. One fish got off the hook, but if we count him, this has been a, a little honey hole right here. If y'all got a local spillway or anything like this, I highly recommend you try the end of it. There's got to be something in there. I'll try one more time right here. Even though I'm already super happy with the amount of fish that I have caught. There's just so many bluegill right here. I know I can catch one of them. I don't know if y'all can see that down there. But they are down there. No, he just nibbled the butt of it. I don't know if y'all can see that. But he's not committing. He's testing it, but he ain't committing to it. You know what? I might have something though that these bluegills will like. Since they're not really committing to the minnow on that side, Let's take the minnow off. Okay. And I have some of these gulp earthworms that I'm gonna throw on there. Hopefully these are money. That's where we're looking at. And let me tell you, do these guys stink? But I think that is a good thing. I think they're more likely to bite if they got a little scent on it. Nothing too much. We're gonna throw about that size on there. Well, the flies like it. That means it must be stinky. All right, y'all. That is what we're working with. Hopefully we get something. It's super stinky and nasty. I think they're gonna love it. Let's go ahead and Throw this back over here where they've been wanting it, but not taking it. I want y'all to take it. This might be the game changer here. They are thinking about it. Oh, he's took a bite. They're taking bites down there. Oh gosh, he took the whole thing. Okay, okay. All right, they like it. They, they're they certified liking it. Put that junk right on the tip. They bit everything but the tip right there, I swear. But now they know that, hey, this is tasty. Hmm, let's see if that gets, uh, let's see if that gets one. They certainly ate the last one, so. Their pickiness has worn off. Oh man, he, they're like so good at not biting the hook. Oh 
my gosh. They're just trying to take it and race away. Yes, yes, y'all, that is how it is done. That is how it is done. Yes, gosh, that makes me so happy. <laughs> wow, that worked so well. That worked so well. He's a beauty. I'm gonna go ahead and try and let him self-release over the water here. Yep, there we go. See you later, buddy. <laughs> so awesome. Let's try and get one more. That was too cool. This, uh, these gold worms are really working magic. I'm throwing one more on there, but I highly recommend them. You'll get some bluegill, some crappie, whatever wants to bite it. Oh, I thought I was on again, but they are biting. Oh, he took my worm. All right, I'm putting one more little guy on here. That's too funny. They keep stealing. I'm out here feeding these guys. Doing a good service. I care about the animals, people. They're so good at like just pulling it off of the hook. So the more times I can wrap it on there like that, the better. All right, let's go get them. Aha. Honestly, I might not even cast it. I'm just gonna drop it right here. Cause they know about it, they are hungry and they are eating on it. I hope y'all can see it. Oh, they are attacking. Yes, y'all got another one, yes. <laughs> and it is that easy, oh my gosh. I have never had such a good time fishing as right now. I mean, these little panfish are so much fun to catch. Especially if you're having a hard time getting any other fish, man. Just find you that little creek that no one else fishes and go to town on it. Come on, there we go. Wow, guys, look at how small this little guy is. But how much fun, how much fun that is. Right back to his family. So much fun, my goodness. I'm literally just going to dangle it down there again. Let's see if they uh, saw their compadre. Oh, he just stole it off. <laughs> they are hungry down there. Well guys, that was an excellent day of some micro pan fishing. I could not have asked for anything better. Little scenic little waterfall over here. I highly recommend if you got any bit of a drain like this, y'all go hit it. Cause over here in this little pond area, uh, those are the honey holes you wouldn't expect. So thank you guys so much for watching. I truly appreciate it. I hope you guys have a good rest of your day and happy 4th of July. Please like and subscribe. Thanks very much. Have a good one.